Hi, Matt here from Crooks Cabin Makers. So today, um, I'm gonna take you guys on a little road trip and gonna go and pick up some nice timber and uh, show you what I make with it. So let's crack on. All right. So I've got to the timber yard and I picked up this bit of oak here for the next bit of project. And um, it's looking really gorgeous and it's just working out where the cuts have got to go for economics and um, just the best part of the timber to use for the job. Okay, so let's have a quick talk about my setup. I've got the largest size Makita belt sander. This is ancient, but it's still going strong. And um, just attach the Henry Hoover directly to it. And on the bottom there, <coughs> I've got 40 grit. So yesterday I was out, <coughs> I tried this method to get these down. I, was, <coughs> I tried the method to get these down nice and flat, and I found it was reasonably successful but I killed a couple of belts and I needed some more so I've upgraded to 40 grit just to get this down and I'll work through the grits later um, I'll go to around about 80 grit and finish with the grain on 80 grit and that should be enough so what I'm doing here is I'm sanding diagonally across the grain at 45 degrees um, in both directions and that produces a really, really flat surface. So to be clear, I wouldn't recommend, if you want perfectly flat boards, I wouldn't recommend this method, but actually that is very good. So I'm back in the workshop now, I've done all my sanding, and now what I've got to do is kind of lay this project out and see how it all fits together, see the problems I'm going to face, um, especially with the wind, problems like that, and the thickness, the overall width, and um, just get a feel for the project and see where I'm going with it.
right, so just a little rundown of the gear I'm using to make these tenons. I've got a series of templates. This is obviously the mortise, and this is the tenon one for that one. So all the planks are different sizes, so I've used different spacing. So to run around the tenon, I've got my large size Makita. And in there, that's a 19 mil by 50 something mil. Yeah, 50 mil twin flute cutter with a roller bearing at the top. This is the standard 80 grit sanding discs. And as you can see, I've gone through three of those, totally ruined. And there's my mesh one, still on the same one, still got some real sharpness to it. The extraction from these is fantastic. It's almost perfect, like there's nothing there. 